Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. I hope you all are doing well. So today I have created this look on smoky eyes with pink lips. This is more of a highlighted look rather than a contoured look. So if you guys are interested then please keep on watching. Today I'm going to do my eye makeup first. So for that I'm using a base with a foundation brush. The base that I'm using is from Kralon Derma Base uh, and setting it with a powder. You can use any foundation that you have or any concealer that you have so yeah now taking a big crawl on eye pencil I'm drawing a thick line and smudging it out with a black eye shadow using a stiff blending brush from Vega brush kit taking this brush which is a small blending brush I'm blending out the harsh edges and in the next step, I'm taking a fluffy blending brush to blend out the eyeshadow even more. Smoky eye is all about blending, blending and blending. So you need to be really patient and careful because it takes quite a lot of time in order to get that perfect smoked out look. Using the same fluffy brush, I'm placing this brown brown eyeshadow slightly above my crease to create a depth and also to give definition to my eyes. This step will ensure that your eye makeup is completely blended in, therefore giving you the perfect smoked out look. Now using this brush which is the perfect dew from MAC 217 because this is slightly pinched at the bottom and fluffy at the top, I am placing the black shade all over my eyelid and then again blending it out. So once that is done, I will again go over with my trusted fluffy brush and blend everything together. Using a white matte shade, I'm highlighting my brow bone and taking it towards my inner eyebrow just to clean out the area. Now using this flat eyeshadow brush, I'm placing this bronzing sort of a color all over my eyelid but mostly concentrating on the inner half and then dragging it towards the outer corner and again blending out the edges with a small blending brush. In the next step, I'm tight lining my upper and lower waterline using the Plum Nature Studio Kajal. This is one of the best kajals available in the market. So yeah, for my lashes, I'm using the Maybelline Lash Sensational Mascara both on my upper and lower lashes and then smudging out the lower lash line using a black eyeshadow. And then going over with brown shade and placing it on my lower eyelid using a small blending brush. So I went ahead and did the other eye and my foundation as well. And if you're interested to know how I do my full coverage foundation routine, then please check out my previous videos. I leave the links in the description box down below. So don't forget to check it out. Now I'm using the yellow color from the Makeup Revolution Contour and Highlight Palette and placing it on the under eye area on my forehead, on the bridge of my nose and also on my chin using a Real Techniques foundation brush just to brighten up those areas. And then setting everything together using the L'Oreal Infallible Compact Powder. For my contouring, I'm using a brown shade from the same Makeup Revolution contour and highlight palette and contouring my forehead jawline and also using it as my blush with a contour brush and then in the next step I'm using a small brush to contour my nose. Always try to build up your product rather than taking a lot of amount at the first time be it your foundation, your contour, your blush, eyeshadow or anything that you're using.
now using this highlighting a tint from the same palette first i'm highlighting my nose with a small eyeshadow blending brush and then moving on with a fluffy blending brush to highlight my cheekbones forehead and also my chin Now using the darkest shade from the Makeup Revolution Brow Kit and the brush it comes with, I'm filling in my eyebrow starting from the outer corner and then going towards the inner eyebrow. While you are working with your brows, you need to be really patient and careful or else you are going to mess up everything and always remember to go in with small strokes. Next I'm applying the nude lip liner all over my lips. This is a great liner for any skin tone because it acts as a concealer and hides any discoloration that you have on your lips. By the way, this is from Avon. Uh, I'm then going over with a liquid lipstick from In Color Matte. So yeah, this is pretty much it. I hope you all liked watching this video. If you did, please do not forget to hit the like button, subscribe to my channel and leave your comments down below. Until next time, stay tuned and stay happy. Bye!